What's going on guys? I'm going to do a quick video today of the difference between factory trigger pull in pounds with the uh, trigger gauge you saw me use in my other video um, and then with the upgraded HB Industries spring kit for the Evo. So real quick, I'm not going to do an install video. There's another good video uh, on YouTube already of how to install it. So I'm just going to show you the difference between factory and then... Um, with the upgraded spring kit. All right. We are clear. Clear. There we go. Okay. Well, it's safe to say that the factory trigger, as noted by uh, many other people, is that it's heavy. I mean, it went over my gauge, it stopped at 8 pounds, um, you know, it can go further, but it was um, 8 pounds. So let's do it one more time, see what it does. Way off the gauge, I'm thinking nine, 10 pounds. So anyway, that's a good baseline. Just a couple pulls, we know it's heavy. Let's see what it goes down to after the spring uh, kit is installed. Uh, be back in a second with the results. Did the trigger pull, it was um, eight, 10, 12 pounds. Um, so let's see what it is now. Uh, with the tr uh, the kit installed, uh, advertised is supposed to be down to you know around six pounds. So let's see what it says. A little over five and a half pounds on that one. Let's do it again. Five and a half pounds. One more time. Five pounds exactly on that one. So you're looking at about a five, five and a half pound trigger. Um, that last one, I think I had the, the plunger there more towards the bottom. That's probably where your finger's gonna be anyway, more towards this, this area. So you're, you're looking at a five, five and a half pound trigger. And I'll tell you one thing, it is a lot smoother and obviously a lot lighter than your than the factory trigger. I mean, it's just it's it's great. So you can't beat the price. I mean, it's like eight bucks. Put that thing in there. It's there's a, a good video on how to install that um, on their website. So check that out if you're looking for it. Um, everything that happened as far as this uh, screw being stripped, uh, I found out that. I got one of the few thousand imported into the country that had a welded trigger screw, trigger pack screw. Uh, so that's why it was likely half stripped when I got it and why I couldn't get it out any other way. I actually had to drill it out. So um, I got this screw actually from uh, Home Depot, you know, 50 cents or whatever, but um, they do make a, a hardware kit for the Evo. Um, this It gives you a, uh, a new spring for that that spot should you need it uh, a couple more set screws for your safeties and another roll pin so a couple dollars for this if you don't want to go try to hunt down a um, a you know three millimeters or I mean a uh, uh, a 10 millimeter long screw um, you know so uh, that's just the way to go